Garden friends, welcome back to my small garden. Currently six degrees here in Powassan, Ontario, April the 15th, 2024. Got a couple more nights below freezing, but after that, I can start moving some of this stuff out into my low tunnel to make room to grow more stuff indoors. Let's get growing. Come on, I'll show you what I've got on the go. Okay, so yesterday I prepared 12 trays. These are the two inch blocks. My thought process being that these are not getting potted up. I am so sick of potting up. Good thing it's such a labor of love, right? So they will stay in here until they're ready to go outside. So today I am planting. I had some pretty poor germination on two of my snapdragons that I already planted. So I am doing another round of the snapdragon Potomac Yellow as well as the snapdragon Maryland Plum Blossom. So tray of each on those snapdragons. I am doing marigolds. So last year, I got, I think I started my marigolds about four weeks before my last frost date. I'm currently seven weeks till my last frost date. And my marigolds were like, we're just starting to come into their own. And we get frost typically, our first frost is like early to mid September. And you know, I enjoyed them for so little time before they were done. So I'm starting my marigolds now. I'll be doing Marigold Buttercream, Marigold Jelly Jester, a Dwarf Orange variety, I don't know the name of it, those are just shorter ones, and Marigold Large Yellow. So this one has like the giant yellow pom-poms on it. It's a very large marigold. So excited for that. I am doing Zinnias. I am doing Benary's Giant and Zinnia Queenie Lime. Cosmos. Same thing last year. My Cosmos, I think I started them four weeks before my last frost date and they were just starting to really look beautiful covered in blooms and wiped out by frost. So starting them earlier this year. I have chosen Xanthos Cosmos and Cosmos Early Sensation. Calendula. I have put Calendula in my vegetable beds, you know, to act as a trap crop and a little bit of extra beauty, that sort of thing. Uh, this year I am doing Calendula Fruit Burst. Very excited for that. Amaranth Red Garnet. This is such a beautiful show of red in the garden. The leaves are red, the flowers are red. It's just, it, and it's gorgeous, tall, beautiful, lots of that. I am doing the Celosia Forest Fire. I did a few of these last year and it was stunning. So this year, more. I'll just do more. And then last but not least, my first time doing coleus from seed. So I picked a coleus black dragon. So here we go. So a few of these things, I only did the 12 trays. I don't know if you're counting, but there's more than 12 here on the table. So some of the marigolds will have to be a shared tray. I'll split it half and half, but let's get planting. And there we go. 12 more trays planted and ready to grow. Now to get outside and play. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Now get growing.